Welcome to lesson 8 of Open Office Calc. In this lesson, we will be looking closely at conditional formatting. There are several ways to make a spreadsheet easier to understand, read and interpret. Conditional formatting can be used to enhance the readability and understanding of a spreadsheet. When, one's one, when one wants to automatically highlight only the cells which meet a certain criteria, one has to use conditional formatting. Looking at our example, in our grade 12 egg geography mark sheet, the last column indicates whether a learner has passed or failed. We want to apply conditional formatting to the last column so that we can see easily whether the learners have failed. Firstly, select the range of cells that you want to apply the conditional formatting to by highlighting the range of cells. So I want to highlight from cell D8 to cell D15. Once I have selected my range, I thereafter click on the format tab in the menu bar. Then scroll down and click on the conditional formatting option. Specify the criteria that must be tested. In our case, we want the cell value to be equal to failed and failed must be typed within double quotes. Finally, we select the style of formatting that you want to apply or create your own custom style. We will create our own custom style. So we click on the new style tab. Let's give our style a name. We will call it my style one. In this particular style, I want to change the background color. So I click on the background tab and I want to change it to red. So I choose the color of red. On the right hand side it gives you a preview of the background color. Then click on OK. Once my style has been defined I thereafter click on the OK tab. My sheet has now had the styles applied and it is easy for me to read which learners have failed. So I have Mary White, Jackie Mabizela, Nampumalela Mbata and Sandy McGowan. Note that in the result column all the cells that have a value of failed the background color has been changed to red. Let us apply a second conditional format. Once again Select the range of cells you want to apply the formatting to. Click on the Format tab. Scroll down to the Conditional Formatting option. Tick the Condition 2 checkbox. Cell value is equal to, and in this case we want to have pass. Again, must be within double quotes. A S S create a new style again let's call the style my style 2 I want to change the background color to green there's my preview click on OK click on OK again and when I come back to my document, I find that those learners who have passed, the result has passed, the background of that cell is now green, and those learners who have failed, the background of those color, or the background of that cell or those cells are now red. 